Hey guys, welcome to Freedom in a Budget. It is Way in Wednesday on Weight Watchers Simply Filling, not Freestyle. So as you guys know from last week's video, I decided to give Simply Filling, even want to say uh, Freestyle, Simply Filling a try and it's been an interesting week. I have had its ups and downs. There was actually two days that I did not track on Simply Filling. It was just too much with eating out and this and that and so it is what it is. So I gained 0.3 pounds this week, which I have had in Simply Filling. Sometimes it takes the following week for it to reflect on the scale. So I hope that's what it is. Sorry, I'm fidgeting with this ribbon that we're gonna talk about in a couple minutes. Um, so it is, it is what it is. Last night was a fail day. I had um, French toast, which French toast has been like one of my go-to meals on Simply Filling, which is just so delicious. So I just use um, reduced calorie bread and then eggs and some vanilla and cinnamon, mix it all up. And then I just use some butter spray and sugar-free syrup. So it's just one or two points depending on how much sugar-free syrup I use. Or not the sugar-free, the light syrup. I haven't found the sugar-free. Um, I shop at Aldi, so I don't have it there. So I just use the light and it's like one or two points depending on how heavy I am. And I just use it on the measure on the food scale. So it's perfect. Um, but I'm really enjoying it. So I had that yesterday and then when my coworkers went to one of my favorite places um, by our work, it's just this Italian place with this chicken cutlet sandwich with on focaccia bread with f fresh mozzarella cheese and provolone cheese and balsamic vinaigrette and it's just so good. And so she split it with me or I split it with her and it was just delicious. And then we got home and Jimmy really wanted Chick-fil-A and I haven't had Chick-fil-A in months, months guys. And so we went to Chick-fil-A. We treated his parents to it. Um, so, cause they're in town. So we decided to do that. And so I weighed myself yesterday and then I weighed myself this morning. Today's my official weigh-in day. And I was only, I was the same exact weight. So even with the Chick-fil-A and everything, it didn't reflect on the scale. Um, it was the same exact up 0.3. So I'm okay with that. But some good news is my ribbon, if you guys can see, it's been two weeks now. It is a little bit smaller. Just a little bit. I have the dates on the back. Um, so it's just a little bit smaller, like not even a quarter of an inch, probably like an eighth of an inch. But you know what? It's in the right direction. Um, so I'm excited. I really like this ribbon trick and it'll be fun to see when I have like 10 ribbons or so um, on here just to see how it's how it's going to play out. Um, like I said last week, I haven't noticed too many changes like in my weight. It's been up and down the same, I feel like three or four pounds, but I'm, I'm seeing differences in my body. I'm seeing difference. Like when I walk by the mirror, I'm like, oh, okay, I'm, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. And so it's just been, it's just been fun to see that. Um, sorry if my hair's losing its curl. I curled my hair for the first time in like years today and I feel like I have some, some Texas hair and it's not really doing what I want it to do because I'm not good at it. But I want to practice because Jamie likes it curled. So we'll see. We'll see what it does. Um, so yeah, so it, it was a good week overall. I am excited to try Simply Filling next week. So this week for lunches I did meatloaf, mashed potatoes, and veggies and it was great. The entire meal was simply filling. I made it some banana muffins, just the banana oatmeal muffins that you guys are seeing all over. It's really a loaf of bread that people are doing it, but I'm doing it in muffin form just because that's easier for me. I don't have those mini loaf pans and I don't want to buy any. And so I'm going to make them again, but they were entirely simply filling, but they were, they were good, but they were kind of diet tasting. They didn't taste all that great. So this week I'm going to add some apples. So I think I'm going to saute some apples in just some water and cinnamon and try to get them a little bit softer and then add those to it and do, um, maybe put some mini chocolate chips in it and only count one point for them. So I don't know. I'm excited for that. I'm going to do that. And then this week I found this like Mexican casserole, um, that uses like, um, tortillas and different things. And it's almost like a Mexican lasagna type thing. So I'm gonna try making that with some veggies on the side and some like fat-free Greek yogurt instead of sour cream, some black olives, so I'll have to count point for black olives, um, some shredded lettuce. I think it's gonna be really good. So I'm excited for it. Um, like I said, the French toast is like my go-to. I've been having that for, so basically, I've been having 
my coffee, the muffins for breakfast, um, the meatloaf for lunch, and then French toast for dinner. Um, which I'm not really mixing up my meals too much. I did have some chicken um, one night. One night this week, I'm gonna try that recipe that Carrie did with you take the chicken breast and then you slather it in um, sour cream and then you crush up Cheez-Its and chili. You mix together crushed Cheez-Its and chili powder and then make crusted chicken with that and then you just have to count the Cheez-Its. So instead of sour cream, I'm going to use Greek yogurt. Although sour cream or Greek yogurt, it, sour, fat free sour cream is free on fruit gel. I don't know, we're gonna see. So I'm gonna do that and um, try that this week. I'm excited for that. And I think Jamie's gonna like it a lot. So we'll try that this week. And yeah, so it's been good. Um, like I said, I haven't really been mixing up my meals, so I don't know if that's kind of stalling the weight loss as well. What do you guys think? Do you, do you feel like you eat the same thing and you lose, still lose weight? Or if you mix it up, it's better because it's kind of tricking your body. But I don't know, what do you guys think? It's definitely been fun. I've enjoyed it a lot. It is kind of scary only having like five points a day because you only use your weeklies on Simply Filling, but it's a good challenge. It's good to kind of be like, no, don't want to use my weeklies on that. We're gonna, we're gonna pass on it. So I don't know, I'm liking it. All right guys, let me know if you've tried Simply Filling, what are your ideas? What, what have you guys done? I really want to hear from you and see what's, what's up. So I will talk to you later, bye.